versus Jerry Burke. Going into the race against Jim Howe, I mean, I knew he was tough. I had to be confident in myself, confident in the team, and confident in the car, and, and it, it panned out this weekend. Let's go, Jerry. <laughs> Good race, homie. Good job. Good job. Make the whole trip? I knocked him loose in the middle of the track. But... We've been working our ass off to try to, to get this car to run good, and it only took 8,500 foot elevation to do it. I muscled it to the finish line. I thought I could catch you. Good job, Jim. Good job, buddy. Me and Jim. Jerry Bird in the finals. Will you come help me? Jerry? Yeah. What do you need? I need you to look at my computer. It's losing the tire and the shift. And... Okay. Yeah. Well, what you got, man? What you got? Oh, uh, we made the shift and lost the tire. Well, what do you think? It's rough as <laughs> there, but I think it's the first time we've done it. It's been going down good every time. We've done the same tune up. You short shifted it on this one? No, this is where we normally shift it. Yeah. Put a shifter tar down. Um, That's what we was talking about doing, putting the shifter tar in it. Everything's buttoned up up front. We put fuel in it after we started it? Yes, sir. Can I check it one more time? No, as long as you guys know you did it, I don't care. Thank you. Here we go. Huh? Here we go. Hell. That's what you've been doing all day, you know? Spice it up a little bit. <laughs> Here we go. This is the Invitational Finals Drivers Meeting. Folks, one of these drivers is going to walk out of here with $40,000. Brandon James, sir, this is your first finals appearance. You've never won a no prep Kings race. How nervous are you right now? I'm actually pretty calm, cool, and collected right now. You know what? I figured you were going to say that because I've watched you mow through a whole bunch of badass street racers and win $100,000 in Mega Cash Day. So you know what? I knew that answer was coming out of you. Now, Jerry Bird, this is your seventh time to be in the finals. So you have been the bridesmaid seven times. You have seven silver medals to your name. What do you think about getting that gold medal tonight? I gotta win. <laughs> well, that is right. But hey, guess what? I got good news for you. You are in sole possession of third place in the points, so you are making up ground. We're going to go ahead and flip a coin now. Who is going to call it in the air? Call it. All right. Brandon James will call it in the air. Here you go. Heads. Heads is the call. Heads is the coin, sir. Your lane choice. Left lane. Brandon James will take the left lane. All right, gentlemen. Be safe. Good Bye. luck. Be safe. I mean, I know Jerry's been running good. I know he didn't make that last, the last pass. He didn't make the full trip, but I'm confident going in this final. I'm excited for you. The fact is, you just gotta go out and do what you've been doing all day, dude. Yeah. I'm gonna go up there with winning in mind, and I'm gonna put the fastest tune up that I think that track's gonna take. I figured out. We lost the tire two or three. I have to go put a shift, a check in it. Three degrees, you check it, put it back in. Back to shift. Mm. I don't know why I did. Didn't shake or nothing. Just lost it. Does Brandon James look like he's running hard? Yeah. Good. <clears throat> Does he look like he's running hard? I don't think so. No? Hey, don't go out there and up. You've no. Before. I wouldn't try to lean on or do something yeah. stupid. Seven times. What happened on the last pass? Why'd you get out of it? It, shook, it, it lost shook. it. It didn't shake. It just lost it. Yeah, hey, all the way. Just go out there run your race. I wouldn't think too much about it. I mean, he's running good, but he's going to go down the track, so. Because I've been telling everybody all weekend, Brandon's fast. You know, I've been watching him. I've been doing this a long time, and I can tell who's fast and who's not. And uh, he's really fast. I can't leave nothing on the table. I got third place all by myself. I'm in sole possession of it. Uh, in order to beat Brandon, I got to go out there and run my race, and I think I can get around.
It doesn't really matter what he does on the light. I don't really get rattled like that. He can double bolt me. He can go in fast. It's not going to affect me. I'm going to run my race, and I'm going to leave on that green. I got to win this, man. I've been here six times, seven times. I need to win one. <laughs> Jerry Bird in the final. We took the light. I let go of the button. I felt like I got out on him. And it was a drag race all the way down. I mean, we were side by side, door to door, and uh, just didn't have enough this week. He beat me by inches, and I'm happy. The, the team, we worked our ass off, and, and we got to a final. So the goal is to win one now. Oh, God. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Hey, good job, Jerry. He was right there. <laughs> Close. Thank yeah. you, bro. Good job. Good job. Oh. oh, this feels great, man. I've been fighting for this for three years. You don't know how depressing it is to go get to a final and not win it. I mean, I've been there. This was the seventh time, and I finally got one, man. It just, God, it feels so good. Oh. Hey! Oh, oh there we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry Bird, oh, you are the baddest mf -er on the property right now. Congratulations, Jerry Bird, on winning Bandemir, man. Yeah, well deserved. This means more to me than $40,000. Just because it say I did it. <laughs>